Hello, I'm Julius Robson from the Small Cell Forum, and we'd like to tell you about our new paper on neutral hosting architectures, which you can download from our website, www.smallcellforum.org. This has been developed with these leading providers of neutral hosting services and technologies, who you'll be hearing from in a minute. But before that, let me provide a short summary of what this paper is about. Tarakos and neutral hosts have long worked with mobile operators in supporting network deployments, particularly in scenarios where sharing is beneficial or essential. Neutral hosts can act as a single point of contact with landlords and venue owners in making their property available for lease to MNO tenants. Neutral hosts also represent the needs of building owners and enterprises who require multi-operator coverage to serve their customers and staff. In this paper, we have set out the neutral hosting architectures that are established and in use today. These include site sharing, roaming, antenna sharing, and the various forms of DAS from passive to active and analog to digital. We also look at the new emerging architectures, which are based on small cells and open RAN. These include co-located small cells, the UK mobile operator's new JOTS neutral hosting in building framework, and CBRS ONGO private network based neutral hosting in the US. Many hosting architectures employ the same 3GPP sharing and interworking features that MNOs use, such as Mocken and Roaming. Overall, this set of architectures represents a long term trend of increasing hosting of network infrastructure, starting with sites and passives, moving up to antennas, radios, and now hosted RAN with shared spectrum. The deeper the sharing, the more savings are possible, the faster the deployment, and the more standardised this service offering can be to the MNOs. Neutral hosts recognise that all mobile operators have unique strategies for their network build-outs and have different needs for incorporating hosted elements. At the same time, the mix of different sharing models presents complexity for the neutral host provider, and so are harmonised approaches that are desirable. As we've seen in the UK and the US, Different regions are homing in on frameworks which fit the specifics of their markets. Small Cell Forum's neutral hosts see value in creating a global framework around these to recommend best practice and have proposed this as hosted open RAN. This framework combines all the qualities of DAS and small cells with those of open RAN disaggregation and virtualization. It provides a flexible and modular approach to hosting to meet different mobile operator needs whilst reducing complexity for the neutral hosts to improve affordability and drive scale. You can find out more detail in the paper. But now let's hear from the people and companies that are behind this hosted open round proposal. Neutral hosting is important to extend the capability of operators to deliver coverage and capacity across three areas, indoors, in rural areas where cost reduction is paramount, and network densification in urban centres. The operators can't do it all on their own. Now, historically, we've had some elements of network sharing via the tower co model, but neutral hosting is much more than that, and it requires some network capabilities that Colt can bring. This paper promotes some of the good work already done in the UK and US to bring neutral hosts into play. And for Colt, who have network in 32 countries, it's important to get all those markets thinking about it. Combining the qualities of established tower cores and neutral hosts from several countries and continents, with emerging disaggregated small cells and open run architectures, the new Small Cell Forum 244 document proposed hosted open run global framework. And this is an additional opportunity for our company to evolve towards an integrated telecommunication infrastructure management model, combining the operation of passive elements and active elements, such as transmission equipment, radio links, and fiber to the tower. Thank you. Hi, I'm George Aguilera with Crown Castle. The SCF 244 work item on neutral host requirements is a favorite because the work we do relates directly to decisions my company faces today and tomorrow. We're not only a contributor, but also a consumer because we need to make informed investment decisions over a long term. Whether we identify ourselves as a neutral host provider, a tower co, an InfraCo, a FiberCo, or a private network provider, we invest in what is attractive to MNOs and customers 
and gives us a worthwhile uh, return on investment to pay our stakeholders. The work we do in the small cell forum fills gaps in standards, architectures, models, and general knowledge uh, in industry verticals. The work we do in the small cell forum offers practical perspectives for service providers and industry verticals. Wireless Infrastructure Group is an owner, operator, and innovator of neutral host infrastructure in Europe and the US, delivering outstanding connectivity for more than 15 years. The industry recognized neutral hosting model, the Joint Operators Technical Specification, or JOTS, has enabled our UK business to simplify and expedite technical approvals and deliver more economic and robust indoor networks to our MO and venue customers. The Small Cell Forum and all contributors have done a fantastic job of bringing together, for the first time, neutral hosting architectures past present and future, which I hope will help drive this type of standardization in other countries for neutral hosts. Hi, I'm Graham Payne from Freshwave, and Freshwave are pioneers of multi-operator mobile service in the UK on a new model where enterprise and real estate um, contribute, um, and it's a really low-cost solution to the mobile operators. Um, I'm passionate about this neutral host paper uh, because what, it's, what it brings is a new architecture, new architectures that lower the cost of those multi-operator in-building systems, which will open up more and more sites, meaning both the operators win by more coverage and the enterprises and real estate world wins by having top-class coverage in their buildings. We are pleased to see the details of the hosted Open RAN framework in this report. We believe that an open disaggregated RAN architecture would enable a neutral host to develop a flexible and competitive solution. This modular approach allows best of breed components to be selected from a wide variety of suppliers to build a shared platform to support multiple operators. This framework can enable the benefit of infrastructure sharing while allowing the operators to still work independently from one another. To find out more, please do download the paper from smallcellforum.org and get in touch with your thoughts and ideas. This first piece of work on architectures has developed a framework for hosted Open RAN. We are now working on development of detailed requirements across a broad range of aspects that neutral hosts must consider. These include management, operations, front hall, spectrum and more as shown here. Please do get in touch with Small Cell Forum if you'd like to be involved. Thank you for your time today.